Hey guys, welcome back to my channel as it's the Girl Talk TV. So as you can see, I'm still not home. This is the way I have to upload my videos for now. But I promise you guys, I will be back bringing you um, other content and videos. But I wanted to bring you this. Shout out to Gossip Girl who just dropped this uh, two hours ago on her channel. Um, they found a body. So I want you guys to listen to this is absolutely heartbroken. The coroner's office told me a body that they recovered from the Illinois River near Peru, Illinois, is Jelani Day. Now his family is demanding answers about what exactly happened. The Danville native Jelani Day was a graduate student at Illinois State University studying speech pathology. His goal was to become a doctor. On August 24th, a professor reported him missing after he didn't show up for a meeting they had scheduled. Bloomington police said his cause of death is unknown at the time, pending further investigation. We didn't stop investigating it when we found the body, um, and we're not gonna stop until um, you know the case is done. So if we still get um, tips that come in, um, Detective Jones will still go through that. After seeing the resources put into the investigation into Gabby Petito's death, I have a video that I was working on for her too. Put into solving Day's disappearance. Yesterday, Day's mother, Carmen, told me she was desperate to find her son and get answers about his case. He's educated. He's a productive citizen. And I can't get nobody to look for my son to provide us with those same resources, with that same help. And that's all I'm asking for. Investigators discovered a body in the Illinois River near Peru, Illinois on September 4th, but it took until today through forensic dental identification and DNA testing for the LaSalle County Coroner's Office to confirm it to be Jelani Day. Day's cousin, Ariel Day, lives in Chicago, and she says he came to visit family and friends in the city just two days before he went missing. She says nothing about his disappearance or discovery makes sense. His dad actually has cancer and Jelani is the bone marrow match for his dad. He loved his dad. He would come here in Chicago and visit him at Northwestern Hospital, sit with him, um, you know, encourage him, pray with him. My message to anyone watching this, if you have loved ones and you have a brother, a nephew, a sister, a daughter, you, you, you don't know how this feels, but you can only imagine if you see Jelani, if you hear any news, if if anyone comes to you with any type of lead, call the police immediately. A somber day for the family, especially his mother, who had dedicated the last 30 days to finding her beloved son. I love you so very much and I miss you. I love you, Jelani. Absolutely heartbreaking. I did yes, just get off the phone with is. the family a few minutes ago. They tell me that now is the time that they need answers. They want the public's help, your help, to help find out what exactly happened to Jelani Day. And we'll be sure to stay on top of this story. Let's 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 do that, guys. Let's get this family some justice. I just noticed um, today is the 23rd of September. And tomorrow is the 24th. Gossip Girl dropped us dropped this early. Shout out to her. But yeah, guys, let's let's get this family some justice. Don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And I promise you, God, I promise you that I will be back bringing as soon as I'm home, I'll be back to bring you guys some videos and more content.